Hi there. My name is Dr. Mad. I'm going to do your exam today. Very nice to meet you too. Can you please verify your last name and your date of birth? Okay, perfect. All right, so I do see here that you did take some medicine for your pain. Okay. Well, we're gonna go over some medical history first to make sure that I have all the information necessary to treat you today. Are you still taking metoprolol? medications are you taking? And how many milligrams of that? Okay. Good. Medical history. Do you have any hypertension in the family? Are you experiencing any upset stomach? Okay. Any new onset of headache? I see. And are you taking any medicine to treat your pain? Okay. When was the last time you took pain medicine? Are you experiencing any double vision or blurry vision? Alright. Any weakness with your arms? And is there any tingling sensations or numbness? Okay. What about your toes? Anything here? Okay. And are you experiencing any Palpitations. All right. So what I'm going to do first is I will take your vital signs and while I'm doing that, I'm also going to assess your general health and look at how your body is perfused and functioning from the outside. Let's go ahead and sanitize my hands. I'm just going to place here. My pad. Okay. This is going to go on your index finger. We're just going to take your oxygenation and your heart rate. Good. So I'm going to need you to keep that there and while we're doing that, I'm going to take your blood pressure as well. Okay, so let's go ahead and take your left arm here. kind of like a big squeeze, big hug. Okay, so just relax for me please.
Okay, blood pressure is indeed a little bit elevated. That could explain your headaches. Okay, so let's go ahead and just take this down. listen to your heart and your lungs. All right. I'm just going to slide the stethoscope under the shirt. Is that okay? is a little bit elevated. I would say it's in the 90s and we are going to confirm with the pulse oximeter just to make sure that it is correct. Okay, let's go ahead and take a deep breath in and exhale. Very good. One more time. Take a deep breath in and exhale. Breathing also sounded pretty much okay. I could not hear any type of infiltrates. Okay, I'm going to put some gloves on. start examining your full body starting with the head moving down to the toes as well and I'm gonna need you to be as relaxed as you can okay your head. Any pain there? Okay. I'm going to pop it your face. And I'm going to check your lymph nodes as well. And under your chin. So we're palpating preauricular lymph nodes, post auricular lymph nodes, and above the clavicles. Very important to check those. Can you go ahead and lift your arm up? We're just going to check with your under the arm okay and your other one good okay how was that did you feel any kind of pain okay so moving down to the thoracic area i'm just going to first do a percuss and then we're gonna go from there okay let me know if you feel any kind pain as I'm doing this. Okay, main organs seem to be unenlarged. 
I'm not sensing any fluid. Okay, I'm going to palpate your arms, so go ahead and relax them for me. I'm going to take some measurements and want to see if there is any type of inflammation. So we're going to start with the chest area. Good. And I'm going to take a head circumference as well. And just relax for me as I'm taking a few measures in here to check for asymmetry. Okay. Alright, let's go on and check the circumference of the arms. Good. Left and right, good, and length. Go ahead and extend your index finger for me. Okay, extend your index finger. All right, I'm going to check your waist as well. So we're looking for any swelling around the belly area. Okay. And sometimes our lower body can be a little bit sore as well and sometimes swollen if we lay down too much in bed. I'm just going to take some measurements here too. Good. Wiggle your toes for me. Okay, perfect. And now I'm going to need you to relax your jaw a little bit more. Good. Okay. And relax your shoulders. Good. My lateral. We're checking your neurological functions now. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay, let's see here. How's that? Are you experiencing any pain? And now? Okay, there's full function there. Is it okay if I lay down next to you? We're going to do a few vision tests now. I'm going to take a look at your pupils first. Okay. Go ahead and look straight in my nose for me, please. I'm going to shine a light in your eyes. Looking for parallel. So to see if they are dilated and Reactive to light. Alright, that looks 
good. So I'm going to put a few colors in front of your fish and I'm gonna need you to tell me what color you see, okay? Go ahead and close your eyes first. Okay, close your eyes. And what color do you see now? Very good. How many fingers do you see? And now. And now. And now. Very good. Go ahead and close your eyes again. What color do you see? Very good. And we're gonna do the same thing. Tell me how many fingers you see up. And what color do you see? Okay, very good. Okay, now go ahead and look straight in my nose again. All right, I'm going to move the light a little bit farther. I'm gonna need you to look at the light. And as I'm moving it up and down, try to follow with your eyes only. Don't move your head, okay? Okay, can you look right here for me, please? Can I look here? Good. Okay, go ahead and cover one eye. Very good. I'm going to go ahead and help you with that a little bit. Perfect. All right, so go ahead and tell me when you see the light in your field of vision. Now, good. Now, now. All right. And we'll do the same thing again. Tell me when you see the light in your field of vision. Now, now, now. Good. All right. Now, keep on focusing straight ahead. I'm going to wiggle the fingers out of your field of vision and I'm gonna need you to tell me when you don't see them anymore. Okay. Good. 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 Okay. That was very, very good. You answered correctly. I do have some concerns, so we're gonna go ahead and just do a few more tests to see how you're doing. I'm going to start with your face. So I'm going to touch you with two textures. One is going to feel wet, and the other one is gonna be definitely dry. Okay. So I think that should be enough. All right, ready? Go ahead and close your eyes. Very good. And tell me if this is wet or dry, okay? Wet. Dry. Wet. Wet. textures one it's going to feel a little bit sharp so what we want to do is to make sure that we're activating the part of your nervous system that reacts to the painful stimulus this is definitely going to not you know penetrate the skin but you're going to feel that poke now the other object that I have here in my right hand is definitely a fluffy one 
and I will barely touch you. This is what it's going to feel like. And that's going to feel kind of dull, correct? Alright, and this is what sharp is going to feel like. Very good. So go ahead and close your eyes. Tell me if you feel this sharp or dull. Sharp. Now I'm going to touch you on both sides of your face, left and right. Tell me if you feel this equally. Good. And now? Okay. And now? Alright. Some concerns there. You are definitely not able to feel everything. So what I'm going to do is I'll take a few samples of the skin and I'll send them to the lab and see if we got anything. That would definitely explain. Go ahead and give me a big ah. Good. And again, ah. Right. Tongue is midline. Can you stick your tongue out for me? And now move it up and down. Left, right. Okay, I'm gonna try to push your face to the left. Don't let me do that, okay? Good. And to the right. Alright, so a little bit of weakness on the right side there. Okay, so let's go ahead and take that sample. It's going to be especially from the neck area and face, right? Just And from both sides. Good. Okay, we'll send this to the lab. Now this will go in one of the nares, just a little tickle there and a little tickle here. Good. Alright, we need to go ahead and check your ears. Sometimes the headache can be related to something that's stuck inside the ear. So we want to make sure that we're not missing anything. I'm going to have you look this way for me a little bit. Okay. There's definitely some inflammation. Have you been swimming lately? Okay. So let's go on and check your other side. Oh, God. A little bit less redness here, but definitely some 
inflammation, I would say. You definitely need some antibiotics. We're going to have to discuss the insurance plan that you have and see um, which ones we should prescribe, but we're definitely going to have to prescribe some antibiotics for that ear infection that you have in, okay? Um, I would say just ear drops should be good. Okay, I do have here some samples and we're going to test your sense of taste. Okay. Are you experiencing any new symptoms? Alright, go ahead and brush your lips and try to taste this for me, please. Good. So, what does that taste like? It's very bitter. Alright. Um, I have one more and I'm gonna need you to tell me what it tastes like for you, okay? So far you're doing great, I want you to know that. Okay, go ahead and put this in between your lips and kind of wet it a little bit. Very good. What does that taste like? It's also bitter. Was one more bitter than the other? Mm. All right, let's see. We have here one more. Go ahead and try to taste this. What does that taste like? Okay, so this was definitely the control paper. Um, and yes, it's definitely supposed to not taste like anything. Okay, this is the last test strip that we're going to taste. Alright, definitely there is nothing going on with your sense of taste. I do have a few more tests and I would like to check your olfactory nerve, okay? Alright, I have here a few uh, samples. So first, let's go ahead and check the patency of your nares. I'm going to cover one ear and I'm going to ask you to breathe in and breathe out through the opposite nair, okay? Breathe in, breathe out. Okay, and now, same thing on the other side. Breathe in, breathe out. Very good. So both nares are patent. Alright, go ahead and give this a smell. Breathe in through your nose and breathe out. Smells like garlic. Okay. Excellent. So what we're gonna do now is I'll ask you to cover one nair. Alright. Nostril. Okay. And what does this one smell like? Okay. And now we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So go ahead and switch hands. What does that smell like? Mm, okay. It's floral. Yeah, I agree with you. And 
That looks good as well. So let's see what we're going to do. We definitely need to come up with a plan. I'm going to just clean up my mess here that I have. Make sure that before I leave everything looks nice and neat. Okay. Just going to write down the treatment plan. Okay, very easy peasy I would say. We're going to just prescribe some antibiotics and you're going to apply five drops in each ear two times a day, okay? So BID. Alright, and which pharmacy would you like to... Why am I so dark? <laughs> okay. Alright, and which pharmacy would you like to send me this prescription to? Okay, very good. So we're going to do CVS on Dempster Street. Okay. Perfect. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and just take this out from here so everything looks good. And I will see you back in a few days, alright? I'm going to come and check on you.